Hi, I'm Kalia Kuruni, a camping Tyson. I come from Sparta in Greece. We fight today in BIB and I have the honor to give interview to Barker Knuckle News. Look, no one beats us to the pants. This is a good signal. They keep inform all of you for the best fight news and for the best fighters like me. He is undefeated in the squared circle. No one beats us to the punch. He told before the referee uh, when he gave us the instructions, is boxing, just boxing without gloves. I didn't feel big difference. You know, I don't pain anywhere, seriously. Just I was feeling more stiff. I was not so enjoy or more relaxed as... I, I do when I box. I was more stiffy, if it's the right word. But generally, I think all my punches were strong. Maybe if I have a little more experience, you know, I find better the target. But, you know, the opponents on that with the cleats, we accept that she will do because she has background my time. My coach, she has given me the right instructions for the cleats. But the truth is, because me, I'm original boxer, that annoying me. I didn't know all the time hack, all the time hack. But because we have worked that, I feel blessed, we take the win. You know me, always I'm hard with myself. I want always something better. Okay, the win feels good. But after with my coach, we see the video and I see my mistakes. And next time, I am sure I'll be better. I come to be world champion also in Barkenakla. I don't come just for a joke. I'm a very competitive person, of course. I love boxing than anything, but at the same time I love fights, no matter if it's MMA, if it's grappling, if it's wrestling, I am Spartana, it's in our blood, it's not about money, it's about my pride and my legacy. And I can't just, I don't want just to write, ah, Pink Tyson was a good boxer, I want to write, Pink Tyson was a legend in combat sports. My coach is Hall of Fame coach, and I hope in future be a Hall of Fame uh, as an athlete. Do you know, to be a Greek person is a blessed because we have a big history, but to be a Spartan is a title, you know, and for me, that title, it's, you cannot change with nothing in the world. Do you know, I moved out in Miami early June. Unfortunately, cannot train with my coach. Every day we was in touch and he sent me programs. But generally, I was training alone. But I was very lucky because in this training camp, I have Britain Hart. Also, she prepared herself for the title shot. And Joy Betran, Betran her husband, uh, other of the instructions of my coach, Really, I feel blessed in this training uh, cab. I work so hard with Britain Hart and her husband. And I did the same training with boxing. Never get out the gloves because coach, he tell me always I must protect my guns. And as you see today, my guns is okay. I think, yes, do you know, I hope one day to be a mother and my children to be, of course, proud for their mom as a fighter, but I want to be a good mother, good person. I want to be a good role model. And I want to show the people, because we are a fighter, that not means we cannot be a ladies, feminine. I want to have a morals. I want to have a manners. I want to have, as I have the right education, I want next generation to don't scare the boxing and just choose ballet because she thinks boxing you know, you lost your morals or your feminine. I want to look me and you see I can be sweet. The most coaches or people, they tell me I'm too nice for the sport, but it's okay. I can be nice and I can smash face as you see today. But at of the fight, like now, I can be polite to you, to your team, and smile to and hug all the people. Do you know, they have proved me for the WBC World Title Silver. This is my goal. I want this year to, to be world champion in WBC and generally my word is to be a disputed champion in boxing. I sound a little crazy, but you know, I tell you, my priority is boxing, but I want to write history all to all the combat sports. Uh, I want to, that win, he give me, they give me strength, my two nieces and my nephew, Ileana Evangelia Dikeos, Sas agapao para voli. And I wait next week to go in Greece to see my family and my three babies. <laughs>